didn't really feel uh, a sense of uh, ambition until I had children, until I could, yeah, right. until I um, had something to, to work for. Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Because normally I almost feel like I've gone the opposite. Because before I had my son, I was so career focused. This is what I want to do. And then when I had him, it was like I just took a real back step. How do you balance, because you've been away from your kids for a yeah. long time, which is mm, tough, mm, mm. but you, sometimes you've just got to do that. How do you balance having, and I hate saying it, have it all because that's bullshit, yep. it never <laughs> happens, but how do you work it that you can have your family and have this amazing career? Well, it's a, it is a good job for that, for that because you can have periods of intense work and then periods of intense unemployment. Yes, yeah. <laughs> and I'm married to an actor who also you know, is in a similar position. And so we treat it like a family business and we discuss, you know, which which job is going to be better for the family, which role is going to be maybe, you know, a challenging one or an interesting one. Um, And we try and make decisions based on, you know, what's really what's best for the kids probably first. Um, But, yeah, I think it's a – I think – the, the, the criteria has really changed since having children. Mm. The kind of jobs that, that um, interest me now, uh, yeah, um, I certainly have to work in relation to my family. Yeah, yeah, right. Has, mm. having, has having your kids, you've got three children, has that inspired you and motivated you more to go down there, you know, writing and doing film clips, doing things like that for children? Yeah. Yeah, I think it, I, I definitely think it has. Even although my youngest son is not interested at all in my music. Really? <laughs> not at all. So if you put it on, what's he like? Get it off and sick of you. I hear you no, enough no, all day anyway. No, I don't put it. I I don't put it on. Whereas I think I had it on a lot with the other two because I'd be I'd be listening to, you know, track. I'd be working out track listings or listening to mixes. So I'd have it on the car right. a lot in order to, you know, to get it to get it ready. Um, but I'm not, I haven't made an album for a while now, so they were, it's, it, it hasn't been on in the car. Um, so, yeah, he, he, he's not interested, but I think I just... Uh, I mean, I love it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> really love it. How beautiful is that, though, to go, you just love mm. what, what you do? Mm. Yeah. So there's not many people that get to say that. A friend of mine's recently... Um, got made redundant and is following her passion now of painting and she's incredible. But she said, I thought it was normal to hate your job. And when she said that, I'm like, that is so sad and so, you know, so the case for so many people. Yeah, it really is. But Uh, it doesn't have to be, you know. No, it it doesn't have to be, but it's very hard and it's pretty scary to go out there and to go for what for what you want. And I do feel very I, I I spent my Yes, I spent my childhood with adults, but all of those adults were doing what they loved yeah, yeah, to yeah. do, every single one of them. How funny you spent your childhood with adults and now as an yeah. adult you're spending all your time <laughs> yeah. with kids. Maybe you're making up for that lost time. That's hilarious.